This is a first look at the TT Travel Pass platform, which requires incoming travellers to upload vital information, including one's PCR test, vaccine status and travel details. And Minister in the Office of the Prime Minister, Stuart Young, warns that providing any false information could land you a fine of $350,000 and six months' imprisonment. He says unvaccinated nationals also have to upload proof of payment for their state-supervised quarantine when they arrive in this country. We've negotiated with a number of approved hotels. Part of your package as a national who's unvaccinated coming to Trinidad and Tobago, you'll be required to provide proof that you've paid for that hotel room for 14 days. Minister Young says when travellers arrive at the airport, unvaccinated nationals will be dealt with separately and will not be able to mingle with those who have been fully vaccinated. He says though that TNT students who are abroad will continue to access state quarantine until at least August. For students and it's really for those who don't have the means to afford if you're unvaccinated to pay for state supervised quarantine, we will continue that state quarantine for those students. Minister Young reminds that unvaccinated nationals will enter via the Piaco International Airport only. He adds that vaccinated non-nationals who are with unvaccinated children will also enter via Trinidad even if their final destination is Tobago. So you have a vaccinated non-national with unvaccinated children. They still require to come via the route of Trinidad because we don't want to offer that exposure at this stage to Tobago. The minister says the TT Travel Pass platform will benefit both immigration and health officials since travel details for individuals would be available in advance. It also helps immediately with contact tracing. One of the things, the fields you're required to put in is your address. There are a number of health questions on this form that you have to fill out. A help desk is also being developed by the Ministry of Digital Transformation for any assistance needed to input information. Sonolala. TTT News.